Good morning, everybody. Welcome back to Selenix Crypto and uh, welcome to a, a new Gala update today. Just wanted to do an update because it's, um, I know a lot of you are trading it and I know a lot of people are, are just looking at it in general. Gala still has, even after, even after everything that happens, I can barely talk, uh, still has a great and a very big community. Um, I'm not sure if, if the project deserves that, but it is the truth and, and the project in the end is still great. It's still one of the one of the best gaming cryptos, if we can classify it as that, uh, out there, which I still do. I mean, I know they do more than gaming and the token does more than, than just being a, a utility token or something, but that's how I will classify them. But all right, so Gala, uh, yesterday quite bullish after breaking above the 200 EMA right here. Uh, but then the biggest test arrived, and that was what will it do after finding resistance right here at 1625. So that's 0 0.01625. Uh, from there, it tested the support right here. And now, uh, see, the market structure is actually quite interesting because technically it's quite bullish. Like this, this looks quite bullish, especially on the one hour time frame. This is just an uptrend. So in my eyes, or at least according to my analysis, the main test will be around that 1.6 cents level again. All right, I'm going to call it 1625. I mean, it's hard to say, but it's like a 1.62 cents. Uh, 1.62 cents is possible. Uh, but that's the main level. So I'll tell you what needs to happen. I'll tell you what I expect from Gala. That's what we'll do in this video. Uh, before we do that, though, I do want to briefly tell you or remind you that I have my own premium trading group in which I share my own trades as signals, but you also gain access to a chat room full of traders and my own trading guide. So if you actually want to become a better trader in the chat room, for example, a lot of people already spotted Gala way earlier. I did not join because I, well, I'm bad at execution sometimes. Uh, but if that sounds interesting, links will be down in the description. But now onto Gala. So purely technically, Gala is bullish. That's what I want to start with. Then we'll take a look at some other numbers, or at least we'll do that now. And what we'll see is that the volume right now is actually still going up. It's been stalling for the last, well, what is it, for the last hour or two hours or so, so that's not a problem. And the open interest has dropped down a bit since yesterday. So I would say that Gala still has a lot of momentum because the open interest is still way higher than where it was. Um, but the volume, I mean, some sort of cracks are starting to appear in the whole bullish momentum of Gala. So I think that the main test of Gala will be that reaction again to this level right here at 1.62 cents. It's technically a very strong level, as you can see. Um, and just in general, now that Gala is, is losing some momentum, it will be a very good test. So what looks like the most likely scenario right now is that Gala will break through. Uh, and that's mainly because the open interest and the volume are still very high and uh, Gala, its technical market structure is still bullish. So I would wait for confirmation. It does look like the most likely scenario is that, is, is that Gala breaks above 1.62 cents and after that continues rallying up towards this level right here at uh, 1.72 cents. That looks like the most likely scenario, but it really does depend on that resistance level because if Gala finds resistance there once again, and oh excuse me and drops back down towards 1.55 and 1.5 cents again uh, then it's more likely that it will get into some sort of a consolidation and if you assume if you think that bitcoin is going to drop then gala will probably from this consolidation drop down as well towards 1.4 cents again so it's absolutely crucial that gala breaks above that level soon if that doesn't happen uh, it will just consolidate slash range for a little bit and then follow the market which at this moment looks quite bearish. So that's my full take on Gala for now. That's an update. If you do have any questions, let me know down in the comments. But for now, thank you for watching. Take care and bye.